This morning, and Alex, you talked to some of the scientists behind this, and the study says antioxidants might actually help those cancer cells thrive. That's right, Bob and Leanne. Antioxidants help the cancer cells metastasize. Now, that's just a fancy word for spreading to other parts of the body. And some cancer patients say that they're taking this research very seriously. It's when they use that C word, the cancer word, it's uh, your world just stops. And like so many cancer patients, Angela Tompkins thought that taking multivitamins with antioxidants could help her breast cancer diagnosis. Since then, she stopped, and for good reason. As those cells are, are making that trip from the, from the primary tumor to a secondary site, to somewhere else in the body, that free radicals um, can actually be detrimental to, the, to those cells. They might actually be involved in killing those cells. Which means when cancer cells are spreading to different parts of the body, antioxidants are helping them survive the trip. Did this help my metastases? You know, it's, I've metastasized to four areas, to four different bones. In my not having that information, not having that knowledge, have I, you know, created uh, a worse issue. With cancer climbing the ladder only behind heart disease as the leading cause of death in the United States, everyone can be touched by this disease in different ways. So being educated on the research makes all the difference. Everyone, even if people haven't been impacted by it, and more, more likely than not, unfortunately, they will be impacted later on. And knowing about the most up-to-date findings that could be impact that could be helpful for their loved ones. And making smart decisions is exactly what Angela is trying to do. With the help from her family and her co-workers, her mindset is we're going to fight this together. We're going to be okay. My outlook is I've got a lot of positive things going for me and um, I look forward to the future and to remission and to cancer-free days. Researchers want to be clear that if you're healthy, you shouldn't stop having a healthy diet with antioxidants. But if you have cancer, talking to your physician or oncologist about potentially avoiding them and making good medical decisions moving forward. Angela Tompkins works at the Biological Science Department at Notre Dame, and she says she's in the right hands. At the Live Desk, Alex Elich, WSBT 22 News.